Hello there. Today we will read Mindfulness in the City, How to Relieve Stress and Anxiety. It is part of the book, The Spaces in Between. Finding Mindful Moments Anywhere. Written by Manjit Thap and illustrated by Jaspreet Kaur. Let's get started. Mindfulness in the City. It's normal to sometimes feel overwhelmed in a busy, noisy, crowded space. The next time you are feeling worried, you might want to try some of these activities to relieve symptoms of stress and anxiety. Breathing Exercises To prepare yourself for a busy day, take a few moments in the morning to take a deep breath in through your nose and slowly release out through your mouth. Repeat. Sending friendly wishes. Think about your day ahead and who you might meet. You might want to send a nice wish to one of your friends or family, such as may they be happy today, or may they be well today. Stretch. When we are stressed, our muscles can get tense. Pretend you are a dog who has just woken from a nap. Kneel on the floor, push your arms below you, and lift your head up high. Noticing nature. Nature is all around us, even in urban spaces. See if you can spot some flowers poking up through the pavement, or a bird nesting high above. What else can you find? Mindful smelling. Some smells can make our brains release happy chemicals. While walking around the city, see if you can smell any of the following. Coffee, freshly baked bread, a pine tree, cut grass. Paint a picture. Drawing and coloring helps us to relax. Think about your day and draw something nice you may have seen. Listen to music. If the world is feeling a little noisy, you might want to toke some headphones with you and listen to some calming music. Or, perhaps you might not want to listen to anything at all. Eat something delicious. Sometimes when we are anxious, we don't feel hungry. But eating something tasty will make us feel better. Pick up a healthy snack and eat it slowly. Keep a diary. Writing can help us to process what we are thinking and feeling. You might want to record something in a diary, or maybe write a story where you can use your imagination. Have a conversation. It really helps to talk to loved ones about how we are feeling. Spend some time with a parent, teacher, or friend and talk about your day. Sleep and rest. When we are tired, we can become stressed. Our brains need time to relax. Find a bedtime routine that works for you, whether that's reading a story or to taking a warm bath. I hope you enjoyed the video. Have a calm day and see you next time. Bye.